Please answer, sweetheart. What if they never will talk to me? I just want to hurt myself, but then I remember that I can't do that. You know, I've been through that with family where I stay with, like, my siblings, and before that week is over, I'm back on the streets again. If I'm going to be homeless, I'd rather be homeless around a group of strangers than to be homeless around family who act like they're strangers. My mother, um, there is a specific conversation we had when I was 11. She must have suspected because she said, if you ever tell me that you're gay, I will throw you out of a moving car. And we were in a moving car at that point. <laughs> This has been a great experience for me to finally be able to make this film. So tell me again about your Oscar acceptance speech. I'm gonna cry like Halle Berry. This moment. This is truly a dream come true and you guys have given me so much hope. I didn't have an ounce of hope. Just a mustard seed of faith when I got here. Why do you think we're guilting you? Because you're sitting here right now basically trying to get me to change my mind. You know, I told you guys the last week that I used a little bit of drugs. Rush just simply told me that someone had jumped off the, the building up here and um, they had landed right on the curb. Hi, Jakey, it's your mom. I need you to call this number right here. I need to get a hold of Justin. Also, I'm doing a documentary on my life. I'm in Portland. I'm being filmed right now as we speak. And this could be big, honey. I hope that you call. Bye-bye. Love you. Aloha. Alhamdulillah.